I'll be showing how to import existing OneNote content into a new class or staff notebook in Microsoft Teams. Here I am in my new history team and I'm going to set up this class notebook. So go here and click on class notebook. You'll see there's a big button that says set up a OneNote class notebook and I'm going to click this. And I have two options, a blank notebook and from existing notebook content. And we're going to set up the from existing notebook content. Here's the typical screen you'll see about all the things that go into your class notebook. The collaboration space, the content library, we're automatically going to set up your teacher only section and the student notebooks. So your typical class notebook. And I'm going to click next. Here's the new screen. Choose the content you want to copy into this notebook. So in this history notebook for my history class, I can pre-populate the content library and I can pre-populate the teacher only section. So I'm going to start with the content library and click add content. Here are the five notebooks I can choose from. And I'm going to go into my master curriculum notebook. This is an old notebook that I always have my favorite stuff in. I'm going to select some things from there. I'll put in my favorite readings and I'll put in lectures and I'll hit done. So you can see it's going to add two sections from my master curriculum notebook into the content library and I can add more. Maybe I'm also going to go here into my civics notebook and I'll find some things from previous maybe practice questions and readings and hit done. Now what you see here is there's going to be four sections that are automatically going to be pre-populated into the content library. I can also pre-populate my teacher only area. So I'm going to go here and click add content for teacher only section. And in this one, maybe I'll select 2020 planning. And I've got some old lectures and class notes that would have put in there. And now I've got a whole set of content ready to set up. So I'll hit next. And here's the student areas that I can put in the private space. I'm going to add one section. I want everyone to keep a journal and I'm going to click create. Now it's going to set it up. And here I am. My class notebook is all set up. I'm going to expand it just to show what it looks like. If I expand the content library, there's all those sections that I copied over. And if I expand the teacher only, here's all the teacher only sections. So now my class notebook is all set up and ready to go. In addition to class notebooks, this works with the staff notebooks as well. So I'll just show that briefly. Here I am in my Pineview staff team. I'll go to the top here and click staff notebook. And just like before, there's a set up a OneNote staff notebook this time. And I'll click the button. And just like before, I can choose from existing notebook content and I can go through the wizard. So this is the same setup as you had with class notebook. And this makes it really easy to pull in existing content and reuse inside of your team. If you found this video useful and you want to keep up with the latest quick tip videos I'll be putting out, subscribe to my YouTube channel and ring the bell to get the notifications for new videos.